everybody welcome back to another episode of chrono trigger we're here in the mountains chasing down that sword uh before we head on real quickly we do have to do just like put the golden helm on him we should probably give her this so we can increase her magic because i tend to use her fire a lot and it seems like fire is like a weird thing for this forest okay another hammer dude so that's exactly what i'm talking about we're gonna have to fire him Easy enough. Another bird thing. Okay. Let's go ahead and shoot him out of the sky. Okay, I think there's a chest down here. Yeah, there's a chest right here. Mid potion? Okay. Love myself some mid potions. I bought a bunch of those last episode. So we're not dying for him, but... Hey. Who's throwing rocks? Mid ether? Bro, I'm about to come and fight you, dude. Okay. Another hammer, dude. And with another bird. Okay. Man, there's a lot of these, like, bird fights. Which, hey, it's more XP for us, right? And these ones are easy, because you literally just, like, slash them once, and they're most of the time dead. Except Chrono does, like, 10 damage away from actually killing him here, but that's alright. I gotta remember to heal, too. I can't neglect that too long. There we go. Get this chest. 600G. Man, this. Uh, last episode, we were still walking through here and it gave us a lot of gold. Okay, let's use some of those. Let's also use some ethers here. Okay. And then Robo should be fine. Another hammer, dude. As you do. Can I cyclone both of them? Can't. Okay. That's fine. One attack for each, and they should be taken care of here. Bop. Alright. Ooh, it's two fights in a row. I dig it. Let's do a robo tackle on the flying dude. Because I want to do a little bit more damage than usual. Ooh, a crit. 400. Okay. And this, hopefully this will kill him in one thing. Because I don't feel like it... It'll definitely kill him in one thing. I didn't want to have too many attacks on that one. Ooh, three fights in a row. Fancy. Well, we got a boss coming up, maybe. Question mark. Pretty sure... Okay, we can cyclone these two. Oh, wait. Is there only two of them? Then we'll just get rid of both of them. But I don't actually know how much Cyclone does, though. But these guys are both weak, so sh Oh, yeah. Okay. Let's see. Wow. Four fights in a row. Incredible. The game is turning up the difficulty a tiny bit. I like it. Okay, I was hoping we could Cyclone both of them. That doesn't seem to be the case here. And slash that, do that. And with Luca, I can use fire to get rid of the bird because I don't want to attack him multiple. Or actually, I can just have Robo attack. There we go. And Robo does a little bit more damage than Chrono at the moment. Okay, so that is. Oh, wait, is this just a test? Perfect. More birds. Okay. These guys are really easy to kill. Like, these guys are not a problem. I'm mostly I'm just annoyed with the hammer guys. Because I'll ha I, I have to use fire and then I just waste a lot of time. And you think, oh, I didn't mean to do that. Okay, so, no. Okay, I was like, wait, what's over here? Oh, it's another waterfall. Okay. Don't go down the waterfall. I keep doing that. Uh, mid potion. 
Okay, is there anything over here? Nope. Okay, there's another waterfall, but sadly we can't go up them, so. Obtain mid ether. Qu quiet, you'll ruin our ambush. Okay, dude. More birds, okay. Wait, no, I want to cyclone all of them. No, they're not lined up, dude. Okay, well, I'll just cyclone two of them. A monkey? Mountains are so nice. Oh, it's the one dude who taught us the magic. That's funny. Ooh, a safe point. Okay, we're, we're honestly good. And even if we face the boss here, our MP is more than enough. Mid-Ether. Something shiny here? Speed capsule. Okay. What do those items even do? Let's check. Strength. Permanently raises strength by one. Oh. Let's go ahead and use both of these on Chrono because obviously Chrono is going to be with us the entire time. Yeah. That might be like a dumb idea, but um, I'm just going to because I think... I'm always gonna have him, so. Now he's throwing rocks. Okay. Shelter. I don't have to fight these guys. I don't think I'm going to, just because. Oh. Never mind. Uh, looks like I don't have much of a choice here. Oh, dude, again? Oh, okay, there we go. Wait, what's over here? Okay, I can't go up that. Okay, perfect. Oh, it's, a little, it's that little kid. I'm the wind, whoosh. I'm the wind, whoosh. Is that it? He just says, I'm the wind, whoosh? Okay, guys, watch out. <gasps> the sword. Hey, don't go up there. Did you come to take it? The Masamine, I mean? I guess so. I thought so. Wait just a second, alright? Oh, big brother. Where are you, Masa? What is it, Mune? Not again. So... Thought you'd make a name for yourself as hero by grabbing the Masamine, did you? What a buffoon. Humans are all the same, aren't they? It's how you use the sword that's important, not just that you have the strongest one. You, you can't even understand something as simple as that. Guess that proves you're human. What should we do? The unusual test- the usual test them. Might as well give them the chance to entertain us for a while. Alright, here we go. Okay, let's do lightning on one of them. See, let's just like field scope it out. Okay, so they ca I can do magic on them. What about this guy? Can I do magic on that guy? I need to scope out what their strengths and stuff are. I can do magic on both of them. Now, can I do... Can I do physical attacks? I can. Okay, perfect. So these guys aren't really... Oh, he's confused. Let's just do... No, let's just attack. I think our attack is stronger. With her, let's go ahead and do fire, since that is stronger. Let's do napalm for fun. It's a lot of damage. Okay, I like it. Let's do a robo-tackle, since that tends to do a load of damage. Oh, okay. Hey, Masa. These ones are pretty tough. No one's lasted this long since Cyrus. What should we do? We fight them for real. Alright, this is it. No more games. So now we're fighting, fighting them. Okay. 
with Masa's bravery and Mune's brain. We're unstoppable. Ooh. Oh, this guy's large, dude. Forty-four. Okay. We okay. So he's. Um. Let's go ahead and use a mid potion on Robo just for now. Um. Mid potion on Luca. Let's go ahead and do. Let's go ahead and fire him. Let's do a mid potion on Chrono. And with him, let's go ahead and do a cleave. This is double damage, so it should be good. Okay. Do another cleave. Another robo tackle. Another fire. doing a good bit of damage here. Yeah, and even her magic is doing quite a bit here. Uh, let's do a yeah, let's do normal attack. Ooh. Oh whoa, whoa, I need a I need a I need a heal stat. Uh, mid potion. On um, chrono here. 300 damage. Okay and I need to heal the other two. Oh, I definitely need to heal Luca. She's literally... No, that was actually... She probably should have been dead there. I got lucky. I'm going to heal her again just because she didn't basically heal properly. Let's use Robo and heal himself. Let's go ahead and use Cleave again. Okay, 40. Not terrible. Vacuum Wave. Um... What is that? Okay. Let's get Chrono. Let's get me. Let's go ahead and use Cleave. And I guess I'll have Luca heal herself. No, I'll gonna, I'm gonna heal her myself. There we go. Make sure she doesn't get attacked again for some reason. Just like she did. If I didn't heal her at that exact moment, she probably would have been dead. So that was good thinking on my part. Alright, we're cutting through this this guy's HP really good actually. Just cause Robo's doing 300, Chrono's doing 200, and then Luca's fire is just really really good. And we're managing to out heal him too, cause his strongest attack does 100 to everyone. There you go, he's dead. We might be a little over leveled, cause these, these last two bosses have been fairly easy, surprisingly. So. 1500G, okay. They beat us, Masa. That was fun. Do you think they'll fix us? When will they find our proper owner? Yes, it'll be right. Okay. Take the sword. Oh, it's coming down to us. Okay, I was like, can I grab it? This sword is a legendary Masamune. Its appearance would indicate that a great deal of time has passed since it was broken. Oh, it's broken. Okay. Allow me, we'll ride the wind to the base of the mountain. Good luck to you. Okay. So it's broken, so we actually can't use it. Hmm. Okay. Okay, guys, so let's go to Tata's house here. But Be before we do, let's make sure we rest. 20G, dude, yes. I thought this place was going to be more expensive than the other place because it's poor. Um, usually a more, you know, upkept city. But uh, apparently not in this time frame. Okay. Oh, the kid's right here. For Forgive me. Truth be told, I plucked this badge from the floor of the tavern. Some besotted, froggish fellow dropped it as he stumbled out. I th thought to sell it, see, but then everyone started calling me the hero when they saw it, and well, 
I didn't know what to do but go along with it. But it's too much for me, this hero business. I've had enough. Here, you can have the badge. T oh, what was I thinking? I knew it would turn out to be something like this. I ought to have seen it sooner. Oh, letting myself get all swept up when I should have been looking out for my boy. Well, from now on, I'll make sure both of our feet stay on the ground for his dear departed mom's sake. Okay. Oh, let's go talk to the grandpa. Worry not, he is my grandson. He won't let a little thing like this spell the end to his great deeds. He told me already, his next goal is to become the legendary sea captain, Bluebeard. Fair enough. Okay, let's go ahead and take that metal over to our main boy. Just gonna mosey on right through these enemies here. Let's go ahead and give it to Frog. You've returned that, that badge. I see. So you met the lad. There's not a thing I can do against the Fiend Lord. To fight him would require the legendary Masamune, which is no, it matters little. Even had I the blade, I have no right to wield it. Please, leave me be. Bruh, I have the blade. A broken sword hilt? This is part of the Masamune. Something is written in archaic script. I will attempt to decipher it. O I H C L. Rocklem. Rocklem. Error. I reversed the order. It says Melkor. Melkor, the guy from Medina? No, it couldn't be. Okay. There's who men the mass immune. Okay, well I know a place where we can go to mend that mass immune. Oop, there's wait. What the heck was that big guy? Oh stop that you bad boy. What? Alright guys. I think I'm gonna end the episode off here, guys. If you did enjoy, make sure to like and comment as it supports my channel, and I will see you guys later. God bless and goodbye.